trip to Brisbane present on Sunday, a place where you made your debut for Bradford Bulls. Uh, what are your memories of that day last year? Uh, it was a great day. I went down to the wire and uh, yeah, it was my first experience of playing um, in front of the Bulls, famous fans, and um, yeah, some I'll never forget. And obviously, Keezy kicked the winning goal, you know, on the hooter to to get us them two points, and it was a great day. They they did a great job of selling it, York, um, and like I said, Bradford travelled in the numbers, and yeah, um, amazing day. Yeah, I loved it. Kind of set a tone for a, a rival between the two sides. We've seen a couple of really good games since. Are you expecting another nail biter on Sunday? Yeah, they're always tough playing against York, um, and like you said, last year uh, at the top of League One, we were going. Going against them and they pipped us at the end and that caught that kind of uh, like you said ignited a rivalry and um, yeah we look forward to playing them they beat us this year as well Otzel so um, yeah we we need to get them back on them sort of thing and they're above us in the table at the minute for the race for the uh, playoffs so yeah we need to beat these on on Sunday just like we need to win every other game as well so we're looking forward to it. It does have a bit of a knockout feel about it a playoff. Almost a playoff game in itself. It's a bit, it's a bit of do or die, really. Yeah, it is. Yeah, if we lose this game at the weekend, um, you know things are going to be looking even tougher for us. So we've got to get these two points. And like I said, these are above us. So I think they're only a point in front or two. So uh, it'll really pull us back in the race. And I think we'll move into the five this if we win. Um, but it's a big if because these are a great team, and you know they're not uh, where they are in the league for for no reason. They're a good team, and uh, they've got a good coach, good squad, and um, yeah, they'll be up for it just as much as we are. Have they surprised you by how well they've how well they've adapted this year? Um, yeah, I'll be honest. Yeah, probably um, because of how small the squad was, but they've, they've got real quality, and um, yeah, I think they've took everybody a bit by surprise to see where they are in the league. Um, but yeah, that's credit to like the coach. You know, James Ford is a great coach, isn't he? and they play a really good style of rugby. So, um, like I said, they're not there for no reason, and they're a good team. I think they're a really tight bunch of players. Um, and yeah, they've got something really good going up there, and uh, yeah, it's looking good for York. But obviously, we'll be hoping this week that we can uh, overturn them and get the two points back to Otzel. Now it's about sort of focusing on yourselves after Sunday's draw against Swinton. Is the focus now making that a point gained rather than a point lost by backing it up with a win? Yeah, we're a bit negative after the game, as you can imagine, and uh, we're disappointed. But we looked on the positive. We, you know, we were. Three tries down with 15 minutes gone, so for us to pull a point out of that is a bit of a positive, but it's not good enough for our standards. And if we want to be in that five, then we, we've got to be uh, looking to win every game, uh, you know, to the end of the year, and that were probably a point lost. Um, but credit to Swindon, they they really took it to us, and they deserved the point probably even more. I, I think they deserve to win really. So, uh, but yeah, we, we've got to look at it now as a point gained, and look forward to York now on uh, on Sunday afternoon, and hopefully we can gain two points from, from there. You mentioned the Bull supporters earlier from last time you went to York. Similar numbers expected this weekend. York are giving away free tickets with their season ticket holders. Right. It's going to be a good atmosphere and I think it's going to be another cauldron and it looks set to be another a really good advert for a rugby league and championship. Yeah, the, like I said, the last game we played there, were, were, it went right down to the hooter, didn't it? And uh, credit to York, they do some real good marketing. I see a lot on you know on social media how they get people in and that's fair play to them. And the, you know they're doing some real good stuff up there and I'm sure I've seen a lot of Bradford, Bradford things as well, you know, we've sold out coach and all that sort of stuff, so I'm sure it'll be a good game, big crowd, and um, it's up for us players to make it a good spectacle and hopefully we can win it again, but maybe not on the hooter this time.